Let's do my knee, call this big game. Hop off a chick, and it get risk. Let's do no more, I get a chick. She said I'm wrong on my pants and my jeans. She's not a dress, he look my piss. I eat a flesh, you know the rest. Kind of a hundred, couple of Rolex. Shine at the sun, you truly blessed. Just told me 10, and they look more like a hoobie dress. This is on me, got my Gucci shirt wet. Him and my mic gon' be used to the rest. With this group, what they teach you for this? I heard this shit's with a drip, I ain't guess. I'm the boss, man, I can't catch you to this. Let's have a time to put the ice with your wrist 
out to me just to see if we sleeve shirt with my Michael Kors pajama pants and some Uggs. I'm about to brush my teeth, pick out my scent for the day, and then head out. I think I'm gonna put on black opium. I haven't worn that in a minute. brush her teeth and then head out. Y'all, it's such a beautiful day outside. Woo! So she stays four minutes away from me. She's not that far. So let's be in around. I already touched the hair that I was on the way. I'm so excited. I got my water. I can stay hydrated and I brought me a sweater because sometimes it's a little cool in her house so I'm gonna get my GPS on I know how to get there it's just once I get to her neighborhood that's when I get lost I hate like after washing my face and brushing my teeth when it get ashy around your lips and stuff but I will see you all once I'm with my girl we've been fighting feeling when it's obvious that just waiting for her to open the door but this lighting is hitting my hair is in two flat twists usually i'll have it in a ponytail and a hat but i'm not doing all that today we're just gonna be free and i kept it in the flat twists to help keep my hair straight because I get hot in between throughout the night. And if my hair was to sweat sweat a little bit, I didn't want that to impact the straightness of it. But yeah, I'll see y'all when something's sad. Y'all, she said my hair got low. <laughs> let's see, let's see. Yeah. Cause I was blow drying yesterday. I just need to get my ends clipped. I haven't put my ends in so long. Yes, it did get long. Yeah. Wow. One of these days I'll get a silk press. Yes. It's just too hot for it right now. Look how far we got. Y'all, my hair is done. I'm just making it home. Get used to it because one, I have a very little head. But I have a decent shaped head. Like I still got a peanut shaped head. It's just little. So I can't turn my neck too much. <laughs> But it is so cute. I love it. She did such a great job. And then look at my edges. I need to get some more edge control. But yeah. That's what my hair looking like. I will see you all another day when we can do our hygiene shopping spree. I'm going to chill, edit this vlog, um, watch some YouTube videos on my own, make myself some lunch, and enjoy the rest of my off days. But yeah, I just wanted to show y'all my hair. I'm waiting on her to send me uh, the videos and pictures that she took. Oh, I cannot wait because she snapped, y'all. She snapped. So this was her first time doing them this size. And she did such a great job.
Hey y'all, it's September 6th. I know it's been a couple of days that I've gone by. These different maintenance things are gonna be occurring on different days. I got me a package. I'm so excited. And I don't know what this is because um, the things that I ordered are all coming on different days. So I'm not certain what items these are exactly. Okay, so I purchased some new glasses and I'm most likely going to end up putting it on my Amazon storefront. I swear, whenever I get Amazon packages, it feels like Christmas. And even though I know what it is, it's like you're looking forward to it for the next couple of days and then when it actually gets here, it's like, especially when you order multiple things, it's like, what did I get? This is, these are like my classy girl glasses. Cause what? Look at her, hold on. And excuse my voice y'all, um, my sinuses are really bad. I actually had it really terrible yesterday. Like all throughout work, I was experiencing a lot of pressure here, here in my eyeballs. Had a banging headache, my nose was stuffed up, running on and off. It was just terrible. It's a little better today, but I'm still dealing with the sniffs and stuff. But these are so freaking cute. My face is extremely little. I feel like if I were to have on some makeup, some cute lashes, some really long, straight, suppressed hair, these glasses would be cute. But I think they're a little too big for my face. So we gonna have to test these out a little. I'm gonna make it work. I'm gonna make it work. Yes. I could wear this with my hair slicked back into a bun, or like I was saying earlier, I could wear this with some straight hair. Honestly, this is a very versatile pair of glasses. I just gotta get used to my face a little bit. Okay. Ooh, should I try this on for y'all? My hair is still really fresh in here. I can't wait till it just lays down naturally. And my hair just has to grow out some more. Anyway, I got this two piece set. I'm so excited. And I got it in an extra small because one, I've been losing a lot of weight and I need to still snatch my curves that I do still have. So I got an extra small in this gray color Y'all need to get this, okay? I will link this in the description and it's gonna be on my storefront. This, she giving body, she giving body, she giving body, she giving body. I need to get some more in a bunch of different colors. I really like this, y'all. I really do. Like, she looks so good on me. I got an extra small. So, I guess go a size under if you wanted to snatch it. Because I would usually get a small, but sometimes it's too much fabric going on in here. Too much material going on in here. It's just, no, I need it to fit me. Okay? And, like, I'm, like, petite, but also thick in certain ways. And I say that humbly. Um... And I like that. I like being petite, but also thick. You know what I'm saying? Ooh. Stop playing. I know I'm doing a lot, but I just need to acknowledge me and my body because I've just been giving myself a hard time, I'm not going to lie, since being sick and losing weight and stuff like that because a lot of people have been coming up to me like, Ashley, you're getting skinny. I'm like, I know. But... 
Skinny me is still a great version of me. Thick me is still a great version of me. And chunky me is still a great version of me. I love myself regardless. As long as I'm healthy and happy and my man loves me, okay? And he loves me regardless of how I'm looking. But this is what this looks like. Oh, I cannot wait to get both of those done. And my nails, that's just gonna complete the look. I'm definitely going to be purchasing some more. This is something you can wear around the house. You can wear while running errands, going on a cute outdoors date, the movies, you know, just something cute put together. My purchases from Amazon, those aren't all of them. I have two more things coming in. Um, I bought some Dossier perfume. Hopefully I can share a picture of what I bought and hopefully it comes in in time to where I can just show y'all and give you all my initial reaction because this is my first time trying this fragrance but I did read the reviews and um I read the descriptions and all of that and the marshmallow vanilla aspect is what's catching my eye and a lot of people say it's marshmallow heavy so like I told you I love sweet fragrances now so I am bound to like this one I'm excited and then the other thing that I bought was um, the item that I'm supposed to be filming content for, for the campaign that I'm part of, and I will be sharing that with you all on my TikTok and Instagram, so stay tuned for that. And I love y'all. I hope y'all had a great day today. I am off tomorrow, and tomorrow is Thursday, September 7th, and I will be running around and running errands, so hopefully I can have some time to do my hygiene shopping like I want. Um, there's a possibility I may meet my co-worker slash friend Jemaya at Bath and Body Works because I want to browse around and get a couple things for the house and some personal things for me and then I will also like to go to the beauty supply store I need to give me some better edge control because I cannot be out here like this I just cannot I'm gonna tell you why because my edges are always done and I don't feel right when my edges ain't done like the look just don't look right if my edges ain't looking the way it's supposed to um so i want to go to the beauty supply store i would also like to go to tj maxx i don't plan on buying anything unless they have my vitamin c oil face serum or <clears throat> if they have some nice perfumes that's like catching my eyes y'all that's like a quick little update for me um i hope you all are enjoying my vlog so far i know i kind of be all over the place but i kind of try to allow it to transition and flow the best way as i can and for the fact that my vlogs are sometimes all over the place that's just another example of how life can be sometimes life is gonna be all over the place and my life is pretty well structured it's just things don't ever go as planned is what i'm trying to say so uh some of the times when my vlogs are one day and then it's another sometimes i try to enjoy the moment with my loved ones or with myself or sometimes i just have so much going on in actual life i have to put the camera down and focus so that's my quick disclaimer for my vlogs kind of being all over the place it's like all of the kind of all over the place it still flows well or i at least try to allow it to flow the best way possible so i hope y'all enjoy the rest of y'all day i love you and i'll see y'all the next day <laughs>
Fresh off the workout. Yes. I need to get back on my stuff, y'all. I've been slacking. One time, I need to hold a corner. And it's no one. Good, how are you? Hey. Hey. This one. Let's smell it. We, we gotta smell this. One. Hopefully, I can smell this because my nose is in there. Nothing because it's too many. So I can smell the. The I don't know. It smells like candy. Let me put that in my little order because I'm definitely ordering it. What's it called? Sonoma Weekend Escape. Sonoma you don't remember that? Mm -mm. That was like 2016. Oh, I see vanilla. They said cozy vanilla bourbon, y'all. Ooh, that looks like a smell. Let's see. Let's see. Everything smells like what it smells like in here. This was it. Oh, okay. I remember the packaging. I smell the vanilla, but that it's light. Smell, it smells good. I love vanilla. Me too. I like when they go la 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 la. la, uh -huh. la, la. <laughs> That's my part. He's like. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, sorry, which one? They wow for making it that though. I'm talking about some spooky. Oh, marshmallow pumpkin latte. This is my stuff right here. You remember the serum I'm talking about, right? The one you Uh-huh, the one I had. Yeah, this is my stuff. The I shower gel don't smell like it. don't smell like it. Okay, they got an ivory cashmere. Uh-huh, I was thinking about smelling that one too. Anything with cashmere smells cashmere good. Cashmere do be smelling good. I'm mad. I can't really smell this like that. That's because it's too many smells in them. We're going to get the spray and spray. Yeah. No. Oh. Nope. Oh, the Yonis is here. I can't smell nothing. That's not, it's, it's not giving. Ooh, warm vanilla sugar. Have I had that before? I feel like I did. Uh huh. They just changed the packaging. I got. That's like their original whip body butter. I love. I'm gonna have to oh show my God. I'm getting this. Oh. <laughs> Why do it smell like that? <laughs> oh, I could fall in this it thing. Smells so good. I'm getting this. Oh, they got a bunch of different stuff back here too. It smells like some hair cream. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's see. Love always wins. That's right. There you go. <laughs> they, they don't I like it. These be too strong sometimes. I got like 10 plug I gotta show them my stuff. Um, spray, I don't think. White t shirt is what he likes. And I don't think they have it. They do. It's just in a different bottle. I'm gonna get two. Bro, I'm gonna spend like a good $100 in here. Got two of those. Okay, I'm gonna stick to two because there's no other ones that's catching my attention. Maya, where'd you say you go? I done lost my friend. Oh, okay, oh my god, I lost my friend. Okay, you found them. Yeah, at the mall. The body works got hair care, y'all. I think they just started this. Yeah. And they got some and new um, laundry stuff, right? I'm going to have to come back and smell this when my nose is right. Because I really can't smell nothing. Smell this looks like it smells good. Yeah. I need to find another one of these. They look cute. I like the color of this. That is pretty. This has... This is probably going to have a musky smell because it got patchouli in it. Candle, I like. Yeah. Rose magnolia. That look like that smells good. Is yes. it giving? <laughs> it don't even smell like that. That's the body works coming up with. Oops, sorry, y'all. It's coming up with so many different things. Cocoa shea. Oh, what's I this? wish I could it smell. It says oatmeal. Col Collodial. Col oh, we should try it. That was decent. It smells like cucumbers. 
It don't smell like water. What about the cocoa shea? Oh yeah, let me try that one. Try that one. Okay. Let's see, let's see. <laughs> okay. Is this good? <laughs> it smell like my brother. I don't know. <laughs> they don't smell bad, but it just smell it's like deodorant. They got, ooh, they got a blossom and bergamot up there. Let me see that one. Oh, look, and they got a vanilla one down here. Okay, this smell like fruity pebbles. <laughs> I like that. Ooh, that do yeah. smell good. I like that. Yeah, that's I'm gonna get that one. Oh, Shoot, me too. Sure. You want one? Yeah. <laughs> we gotta rack up on these things. Yes, yeah. I'm giving me one. Watch my smell video. Mindful paws, Vietnamese vanilla. Mm -mm. It smell like old people feet. Yeah, that cream that's supposed to help get rid of uh, the dry, the dryness in your heels. Mm. Okay, put that shit back. <laughs> Take the shit downstairs. Right, go, go, go. Oh, they have a vanilla one. A mindful paws. Oh, yeah, that's, that's the one we just smelled. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> right. Coffee whiskey. Mm. Another brandy. They got some nice stuff. I will say this they always snap with their packaging. They make everything sound and look good. Oh my goodies. Hello. Yay, we got our first opportunity out the way. I'm glad I got to spend time with my girl. Because um, we've been talking about hanging out outside of work for the longest. It's just both of our schedules be mixed up. And then honestly, sometimes I don't be in the mood to go out. So I'm glad that we got to hang out. But they have a lot of different scents, though, from what I could smell. They do have a lot of new fragrances that smell good. And there were some that didn't smell that good. But, you know, everybody has their own different scent preferences and me and her both like the sweet stuff so i'm excited to show y'all some of the stuff that i got and there was some fragrances that i didn't want to get that kind of smelled like it would smell extremely well with the, the smells that we already have going on in the house um but i need to smell them when my nose is back 100 percent because the way I'm smelling it now is not gonna be how I smell it when <laughs> my nose is 100. percent So, <laughs> okay, so that makes no sense, but I did good. I've been using my my coupons from the app. I spent 84 dollars and 12 cents and got all of this. So, I got a bunch of refill plugins so I'll show you some that I've purchased so I got the black cherry Merlot that's my boy one of my boyfriend's favorite fragrances and this is my first time getting it as a plug-in so that's exciting I got pumpkin bonfire hopefully that smells good I got Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin. Now this is one of my favorite fall fragrances. And I also got the candle. And I'll show y'all the packaging for that. It's like fall. Like the, the signature scent for fall is that. Cinnamon, sweetness. And then I got a bunch of rose water, ivy. This is one of my favorite all year round fragrances. It's very subtle but clean like you can smell it it just it's one of my favorites it smells so freaking good and every time i use it at the house i get compliments on it i got linen and lavender we'll see how that smells in the kitchen it's a nice clean smell uh sweater weather another nice spa fragrance that i got and then the rest are just same fragrances i showed you oh and laundry day I should have got another laundry day because I feel like I'm going to like this. I love how it smells. And then as far as room sprays go, I got white t-shirt. White t-shirt smells like a Hollister store. It's really nice and clean. I love it. And this is my boyfriend's favorite as well. So I got two. So it's going to be one for the house, one for him to carry around with him. And then I am trying this body butter it's up called uplifting boost y'all this smells like fruity pebbles it smells so freaking good and i can layer this with my um black opium by itself perfume that's what that looks like 
and then I got my Swiss and pumpkin uh, candle in. Okay, now that I'm in the house, I'll show you what the um, candle looks like. Because one thing for sure, Bath and Body Works snaps on their packaging. Why are they? Come on. Because I didn't recognize it at first. I'm so used to all the other versions and it being orange. This is like a reddish orange. Like it more, it's more red than usual. But this is my stuff. I'm about to go watch TV and chill with my man before he has to go to work. And then, um, I'm kind of winging the rest of the day. I'm probably going to listen to some podcasts, watch some videos, take notes, edit this vlog, update my planner, um, and figure out the rest of the plans with my car. I have rehearsal and then, um... I'm in the mood, I'll still stop at the beauty supply. So, game okay, almost done downloading. Uh, let's see what happens when it gets to 100. It's not supposed to drop till midnight, right? Mm -hmm. At the earliest. They might be on some bullshit and be like, nah, you gotta wait. <laughs> Until about like nine o'clock in the morning. How you feel, babe? I feel like Kobe motherfucking Bean Bryant. <laughs> oh! Eight more hours. Oh my god. <laughs> you gonna be thinking about that all day at work. He's smashing on these wings. That's crazy. It came on eight more hours, and that's his motherfucking number. That's my favorite number too, and it's two fifty eight. It's in downtown. I'm not gonna be down here long, but I'm in my church's long sleeve shirt, some sweats, and my Uggs, and then the scent for today is creamy sunshine, pink sugar. This is what I got for my scent bird. Because I'm still evolving and pushing myself to change because let's face it, this is an ongoing process. Okay, y'all, I just left my mom's. I had to come and pick up my speaker for rehearsal. I wanted to spend some quality time with her, but about to go to the beauty supply and then go to rehearsal. Yeah, all my church family at this beauty supply store. It makes me so happy. That just made my day. But I'm gonna show y'all what I got really quick. I did good, I didn't overdo it. So they don't have the edge control that I like. Like, they don't, I guess they're not carrying it anymore. But I got True Edge, so we'll see how that works. Edge Fixer does not um, work on my hair anymore. It used to work really well. But it seems, like it's like my hair can tell when the formula has changed. Because it doesn't hold the same way. So we'll see how this goes. We'll test this out later when we get home. And then I got myself some Vaseline in the Creme Brulee fragrance looks cute so i got it and they didn't have my cocoa butter version so i got that and then i just got some regular clear lip gloss and i love it in this container so the her soul only spent 12 dollars and 18 cents so i did good i was tempted to buying some perm rods but i'm gonna do that another time it's good to know that they're only like a dollar some change here so see y'all later My church, my beautiful church home. Okay, y'all, I know I told y'all not to get gas at night, but I had to get gas. And I'm only comfortable with going to this particular gas station because I used to work here. And I let the people know that work here. If I ever come here at night, like you watch me walk, walk to my car, get my gas and so on and so forth. So in case something happened, they, they got my back. But anywho, <clears throat> I'm getting gas and then I'm gonna go home, charge my phone for a little bit, and then I gotta go pick my honey up from work. So I'm excited because I get to get nice views of downtown while listening to my podcast. I've been like listening to podcasts lately, and I recommend all of you all to start listening to podcasts, at least on like financial literacy and uh, different ways of self improvement. And it just helps, you know, elevate you and your mental on a whole nother level. And it helps in enhance your knowledge and way of thinking. Hold 
I wish I could show y'all my face. I should have showed y'all my face before I left, but I had to put on my new glasses. I have like a really cute, chill Tiana Taylor look going. Still got my rehearsal shirt on, the long sleeve, but I got on my um, Nike Tech black joggers. I still have on my black hoods and these. It is, this is cute. people in the world that are amazing and good and trustworthy people that you can be open and honest and vulnerable with. I still think there are people out there that want to see you win. I know I do. There are also those people that love you down, sis. But shut up respectfully. Don't let people know you're coming. Just show up. Find something else to share. Tell them what you learned recently from a podcast you listened to. But find something else to talk about. Because you are not a conversation piece. Don't be so hard on yourself this week. You are a human being just like everybody else. I just pulled up to my man job and I seen a kitty. I hope I find I love cats y'all I love cats and dogs I love all animals to be exact speaking of animals I'm gonna tell y'all what my favorite animals are one I love owls I love what they symbolize I love them as just creatures okay some of them are scary looking but there are also soft gentle looking owls but I love owls they just I've always loved them since a kid they're cute to me and they raw they strong wise intelligent creatures and i just love them okay they just i don't know what they symbolize is just how i view life and how i try to live life with strength and with wisdom and with patience and all those things you know life is not going to always be easy but um just being able to navigate and take advantage of your resources and know how to apply those different resources to get through so yeah i love owls i love giraffes i love bears and koalas um what else ladybugs butterflies puppies and cats i'm missing some but those are my few favorites so far but i'm about to let my honey know i'm here um i'm probably gonna go inside and have a little drink until he gets off all the way and then we'll be heading home It is September 8th and I worked this morning and I have my dinner because I didn't eat lunch and I got myself some Asian Harbor. Let me show y'all what I got. Let me show. Let me show. I got a Godzilla roll which is fried sushi and some Thai fried rice. Because I only had um, a Godzilla sushi roll from Wu's house. So I've never had it from Asian Harbor, so let's see. They not at this up good. I'm not gonna miss up my nails. But I wanted to share my initial reaction. This is the soy sauce. And this is the Godzilla roll, okay. It, it's it's not as fried as the one from Wu's house. Like the one from Wu's house is way more fried. There's a net in here, so I need to hurry up. So I'm definitely gonna get full of that. <clears throat> Just the Godzilla roll alone. But I want to Okay. This is just the big thing of fried rice. Like, I'm gonna just put some soy sauce on it. But it's like these nets be knowing when. Who doesn't know? Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna just put some soy sauce on it. Let's pick a fortune. I don't ever eat the cookie, but I like to eat the fortune, so. 
and it doesn't come true if you share it. So I'm sorry, y'all. I cannot share what I got, but I'll share up my reaction. Whichever one I chose is the one that I'm meant to receive and have. So what's it say? Okay. One more. And chill. They gave me more soy sauce and sauce, duck sauce, which I will not be using. Stop it. Please stop. Anyway, let me hurry for my stuff to slide in. This has onions, carrots, peas, and chicken in it. But it's regular fried rice. And I'm about to add some soy sauce on it. I was going to get myself a pumpkin spice freaking latte. But we'll wait on that. Because, y'all, it's fall season. Once September hits, it's fall season in my world. It's fall. And I can't wait to start decorating. And if you all want a fall decorating video, please let me know. I will be happy to do that. I think I'm going to do it regardless if y'all ask for it or not. I know one thing. I'm going to watch a nice little fall movie between... The Corpse Bride, um, Coraline, Monster's House. I don't do too many scary movies. I'm a big kid when it comes to the seasonal movies. I like to watch the cartoon stuff. I had the rice before, but let's eat it on camera. I think I'm gonna give me a spoon. Mm. Mm, let's try the sushi on the Don't do too much ginger or wasabi, so we're gonna get rid of those. Oh. Wasabi is just, ugh. That'll probably cleanse up my, my sinus is real good. That wasabi. Okay. Let's open up the soy sauce. And sit it down because they filled it to the exact top. Like I said, Gorilla Sushi is supposed to be fried sushi. <clears throat> and this is supposed to have spicy crab meat, avocado, cream cheese, and cucumbers. Let's dip it, let's dip it. It tastes some sort of wasabi, but it's still good. I don't like it with the wasabi. My tongue, no. Ugh, okay, let's try another one. <coughs> the sushi itself is good. It's just, I can taste the wasabi in there. Mm -mm. I don't know why I chose that one. That was just the first one. Okay. It's something new. It's something that's kind of throwing me off about this. I still prefer Wu's House's version, but this will suffice for now. Never try eating fried rice with sticks. Not too bad, not too bad. There's so many videos for me to watch. I'm excited because I'm off for the next two days. So I have so much to watch.
and I just about got 85% of this vlog edited so let's go y'all I just figured out what I wasn't liking about the sushi this mug got barbecue eel on it I don't eat eel and you know what I don't know how I missed that part of the description but I'm about done with the, with the sushi I'm gonna stick to the fried rice I don't do raw fish and it's not to be picky it's just the texture I cannot handle it it's just I try I just I just don't do it I don't like raw salmon I don't like raw fish I don't even like that I don't like raw octopus I don't like nothing raw that's not cooked I like all my food to be cooked and if it's gonna be raw it better be some vegetables or some fruit I'm like it's something it's something off I just have to share that with y'all. I figured it out. Uh, don't get Gorilla... Sorry. Don't get Godzilla sushi from just any place. Check the description real good. But I do trust the Godzilla sushi that you get from Woo's. Because it's... It's uh, crab meat. Pretty much the same thing. Just minus the eel. And it's fried. Extremely crispy. I'm going to have to see if I can find a video when I had it. And I'm going to insert it so y'all know what it's supposed to look like. You'll get an idea. But okay, I love y'all. I had to share that. <laughs> Appreciate y'all tuning in to my first maintenance vlog. I'm sorry we didn't get a chance to do too much maintenance like I wanted. But we did do a little. And we got some productive things done as well. So just stay blessed. Stay positive. Keep taking each day one step at a time. I love y'all. Please like, comment, subscribe. And turn on that post notification bell. So that you are notified when I post I know I don't post every week, but you will see that I post at least once or twice a month. So keep those post notifications on so you are aware of when I post stuff because I'm coming out with some juice every month. And although I'm still learning and getting the hang of this YouTube thing, we're going to continue to progress and elevate in all areas, ways, and aspects. Again, I love y'all. If this was your first time tuning in, I appreciate you watching my video like i appreciate you joining the family much love <laughs>